What's up YouTube, this is Brevity and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. In this episode, we will be tackling the Forest Temple boss and completing the Forest Temple. So, here we are in the boss room. Oh no, there's nothing in here. It's an empty room. I'll just leave then, I guess. Oh no. It's boarded up. Turn around, Link. Do it. Turn around. Oh no, it's Ganondorf and stuff. But spoiler alert. Let's get what's gonna happen. Trust me. There we go. It is an actual Ganon. It is, indeed. Da -da 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 -da. Phantom Ganon. So, to fight this guy, he's gonna go into paintings and stuff. And then two of them are gonna come riding back out into the art world. And what we have to do is determine which one is the real one. And there's no way to determine that at all. You just kinda gotta guess. So he's gonna come through? Nope, it's the other guy. So stand on the Triforces if you don't want to get shocked to death. And he comes and he just shocks up the map. So it's just this. It's just a big old guessing game. Do you get the right one? I'm gonna call it this guy. It's so you. It's so you. You're it. You're the one. Nope. Run! Step on the Triforces. Oh my god, the Triforces lied. Okay. Determine which one it is. Oh, it's you. It's gotta be. It's gotta be. Yes! Wrecked. Get back in there, nerd. You nerd. Okay. Who's coming back? It's you. It's so you. Darn it. I never get it right. Okay, so the Triforces are, are death. Okay. Tri Triforces are death, surprisingly. But in this game, that is power. It's actually just death. Disguised. Alright, so you. I'm calling it. Dang it, man. Let's turn the center. Right. Dang. Just trial and error. It's just plain out trying and error. Right. Who is it? Who's coming at me? It's so you. I'm calling it. I'm calling it. Darn, man. I always forget. Or I always screw it up. There's no way to determine it. It's complete luck. I'm telling you guys. Yeah, they're the exact same. There's no way to determine. Alright, maybe I just got them. Still looking. You didn't know. Oh. I think it might be you. You just can't turn it around again. Okay. Uh. I'm pretty sure this is the last time before we actually go into the next part of the battle. I'm just gonna say it's you. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so last time we actually have to fight him now. And it's just like ping pong. So he's gonna do his little... And you gotta send it back. Send it back to him. And then we gotta kill him. Kill him. Not kill him. Kill him. Terrible aim. Got a no scope and so good. Darn. Might have to use a fairy here. Back up, Rosef. There we go, he's backing up. I get a lot of chance to like time it right. Oh. He's going with the ping pong here. Yeah! There we go. Coming down. Kill him. Kill him, dude. Jump attacks do you do more damage, so that's why I'm jump attacking. Why did I backflip? Could I got one more hidden there. There you go. Right. Stop jump attacking, you nerd. Oh, he's not doing ping pong. I have a feeling he's going to do ping pong. He's going to die soon, guys. Nah, soon. Oh, I'm, yeah, you can't dodge that. I'm the nerd, and I don't know what I'm doing. All right, I'm gonna drink some well-known milk, just because I have it, and I'm probably never gonna use it except for this moment. Drink it. Drink it. We still have half of it left, so uh, we will pull out our little handy-dandy fairy's bow and finish him off. Whoop! 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 Really? Couldn't have just done it that time. It's so hard to time it. It's kind of delayed on the sword. 
kind of got to start a little bit early. Kind of just swing like crazy. Yeah, we got him, boys. We got him. Let's get an epic narration here. Hey, kid. You did quite well. It looks like you may be gaining some slight skill. But you have defeated only my phantom. When you fight the real me, it won't be so easy. What a worthless creation that ghost was. I will banish it to the gap between dimensions. Edgy. Ganderov's super edgy. Alright. So here's our piece of heart, or heart container. Extra heart right there, so that is... 10 hearts? 9 hearts. 9 hearts. And now we will go get this epic, epic cutscene of the cookeries and stuff. Oh yeah, we also have this little bit of the sage just giving me a medallion. And this sage is none other than my boy. Syria. Epic. Thank you. Because of you, I could awaken as a sage. I am Saria, the sage of the forest temple. I always believed that you would come, because I know. I know you. <laughs> because I know. No. You don't have to explain it to me. Because it is destiny that you and I can't live in the same world. I will stay here as the forest sage and help you. Now, please take this medallion. And there it is. I'm gonna stop. <laughs> I'm gonna stop. You receive the Force Medallion. Saria awakens as a sage and adds her power to yours. Saria will always be your friend. And now we get this bit of the Kokiri. Kokiris. Sorry. Saying it wrong. Uh, there's the dead great Deku tree and stuff. Hi there, I'm the Deku Tree Sprout. Because of you, Ansaria broke the curse on the Forest Temple. I can grow and flourish. Thanks a lot. Hey, have you seen your old friends? None of them recognize you with your grown-up body, did they? That's because the Kokiri never grow up. Even after seven years, they're still kids. You must be wondering why only you have grown up. Well, as you might have already guessed, you are not a Kokiri. You're actually a Hylian. I'm happy to finally reveal this secret to you. Some time ago, before the King of Hyrule unified this country, there was a fierce war in our world. One day, to escape from the fires of the war, a Hylian mother and her baby boy entered this forbidden forest. The mother was gravely injured. Her only choice was to entrust her child to the Deku Tree, the guardian spirit of the forest. The Deku Tree could sense that this was the child of destiny whose fate would affect the entire world, so he took him into the forest. After the mother passed away, the baby was raised as a Kokiri, and now, finally, the day of destiny has come. Oh no, the secret's finally been revealed. You are a Hylian, and were always bound to leave this forest. And now, you have learned your own destiny, so you know what you must do. That's right, you must save the land of Hyrule. Now, Brub, break the curses in all of the temples and return peace to Hyrule. Alright, so that was the Forest Temple. Uh, in the next episode, we will probably be doing the Scarecrow side quest. So, anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like and comment. I'm curious if you guys see you in the next one. Bye, guys.